I'm okay with doing my stuff for myself. Mm -hmm. Well, yes, it's nice to have somebody to, care, to yeah. take a little, alleviate a little stress. Babe, I guess at the but car. that's not your love act, language. Your love no. language is like acts of service. Acts of service would be words, my love language. Right. Yes. Not showing up. Yes, not buy me a designer bag. Right. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. It is your girl T. And you are watching Tea Cooks with Flav if it's your first time here. Welcome. Welcome to the fun. Welcome to the food. Really welcome to the food. Uh, and welcome to the vibes. Yes, I'm here with my girl Joel. I'm not saying about you know. <laughs> oh my goodness! If it's your first time here, guys, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you'll see every time that I post. So as you can see, we're in our T Cooks merch and we're heading to a wedding. She's holding the this precious cargo right here. Because we don't want it to break or spill. It's a we flower vase. I wouldn't want the flowers to shift. <laughs> so yeah, so that's what's going on. Um, I'm actually on my way to a wedding venue. There's a 6 p.m. wedding that we have today. But we wouldn't have access to the venue until 3 p.m. So we're like, okay, so I'm, um, we're on time. Yashika went ahead of us. Um, I have a few packages that I'm dropping off at the post office for those of you who ordered your Riley's Festival Thank you by the way So yeah, so we're heading to Sheffrey's kitchen because you know they have a post office inside and then We're gonna take our time and drive up to Fort Lauderdale where the wedding will be. It's going to be beautiful We went to the venue last night to do a walkthrough and you know to leave some of our catering supplies so that way it would have been easier for us today, which was a good thing. Because at that point, we didn't know that we wouldn't have access to the venue until 3 o'clock. So, stay with us. Come along. I don't think I've ever taken you guys to a wedding. So, that's what we're doing today. You want me to get fat enough? So, my neck roll up. Let me straight now. Thank you, Since I've been here, I've been <laughs> Oh, my God. Uh, yeah. We do. I'm actually very hungry, but it's not, uh, it's not food, but anytime I touch around this place, I wish I freeze there, yeah. from I enter the parking lot, your nose just start hurting. Yeah, like, yeah. Why don't you do it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, so let me just run in. What time is it? 2.34, so mm -hmm. long time. All right, Joe, just stay right stay here. here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, be right back. <laughs> I see, I stopped at Chef Reese. So we just got to the venue. This is how it looks inside. Yes, I know it's magical, right? Over here, we have our food. Hey! <laughs> setup that we have going on Joel hard at work Habir's just right now they look nice Joel
Good morning, guys. This is where I've been all morning. Last night wedding was amazing. Congrats to the beautiful couple. Um, when I came in, it was like two in the morning and my feet were killing me. And I got up this morning, I made some breakfast. Well, Joelle jo jo uh, made some breakfast and your girl is like, yeah. So I'm about to take a shower. Well, look what my lovely, lovely, lovely son decided to do for his mama. And he knows that his mama hurt. He said she forced me to do it. You always rub my feet, though. You have to do it good, you have to do a good job. You have to act like you're enthused about it. I'm training you for your wife, you know, because women love foot rubs. They don't. Yeah, they do. They don't. Ew, like that don't even look right. Bryce, you're massaging in between my toes. Mm. Oh, that's um. Ma mm -hmm. Yes. She, she she's always at my events. No, she has a. Hi guys. I know I said good morning this morning, but it looked very much up like crackers. <laughs> but um, I finally, actually, I, I took a shower. I put on my clothes. And I laid there and I was like, all right, I'm gonna take a nap because I felt so tired. Mm -hmm. And then um, Joelle came back same time. She went on the road with mommy and she came back and, and she walked out of the room. By the time they wake up, I was telling her, I said, why, Joelle, if you're walking out of the room or if you're walking five minutes later than you came, I would have been dead asleep and I had things to do on the road. But I was like, mommy, just go the way I have to do this morning, bring Joel, make sure we run our errands. I needed a nap. That was fun too. Well, let's talk about the wedding. What's, no, that was First a... of all, congratulations to the beautiful couple, Katrina. Oh my God, what was my name again? Um, I know, I soon tell you. Is it Roland? Oh my God, that's bad. Roland? Hmm. Well, I said yes. It's something like now. and, and is at the end. It's Roland. But it's not like I this, it's because we've been talking to Trina, to the, Trina whole the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> Usually I do Dorlan I do. or Roland or something like that. But we're gonna verify. We're gonna get it. But And he was very like he's a very mannerable person, very yeah. respectful. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. It was nice. Mm -hmm. Like just being there, like I know that she was under a lot of stress leading up to the wedding. Mm -hmm. Um I can imagine because mm -hmm. when I was planning my launch, it's a lot. It's, it's a lot. Events generally, it's a lot. You think about so yeah. many different things that, and you it's know, like your heart is in it, you know, because it's your baby. It's your yeah. So it's yeah. like for me, I want to make sure that everything is perfect for the client. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah, but at the end of the day, mm -hmm. you guys saw it. It was beautiful. She looked. beautiful beautiful yeah, her, dress. Oh, her dress i like her bridesmaids dresses i love too. the bridesmaids dresses yeah. i love it's the not grooms. a color but it were yes the groomsmen i love yeah. that everyone was to mm -hmm. wear all black mm -hmm. i really love that it, mm -hmm. it added a touch of class yes, yes. um yes. i also liked how the groomsmen looked mm -hmm. i Polish loved line. yes the groom looked good yeah. in, in suit yeah. sell off yeah. um trina dress sell off yeah. like the vet yeah. Sorry, Brie called us with her drama. <laughs> Why this person want to come back right just so? And then see me try. Um, that car is always park. here. You realize that car always park over there. I don't know. I've been noticing. This is annoying. Not me behaving like a resident. Right? Noticing things and patterns. <laughs> but anyway, guys, so 
Um, yeah, and I liked her hair and the hair the head, piece. The hair piece that she and put I like, on. Yeah, and I like the bridesmaids hairstyle and yes. the shoes had the gold going on. You know, I'm not, I don't, I don't see a lime green anymore. I see short shoes. Yes. She had teach me new word. Because I was like, color. lime green. Mrs. Like, you know, you don't see baby blue, like baby blue, or purple blue, you say periwinkle. Oh, nice. It's like a beautiful color, you know. It's a short shoe. Short shoes on. And she up on, she up on. <laughs> See with her. <laughs> but yeah man, it was it was beautiful. Congrats again. Her family was nice. Yeah. Her mom came in the back. She was like, watch your channel, so yeah. pick up yourself, mommy. Um, it's just a support for me. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, people continually support me. Whether it's booking me, well, you guys watching this right now, you're supporting me. You know what I mean? So and I, I really and truly appreciate it. It just speaks volume it really yeah. made me see the direction where my channel is going and the impact that i'm making mm -hmm. without even knowing i'm making that impact it's so special because it's like you, i see it in her yeah. and then it just it just shows you how genuine she is because then when you guys see it, when we're out and i just start I, like when you guys see her if you see me with her i like stand behind her like a little bodyguard yes <laughs> it's true i'm not like a protective <laughs> and my face is serious until i see what's happening because i'm just like you know yes it's true but people are so <laughs> nice and i just like yeah. i just love that from my cousin you know yes thank you even your beautiful. mom people just stop your mom like you're tanisha's mom Yes. <laughs> but we're like <laughs> So me no me from my P's and Q's. Yeah, because yeah, now they know like, her. They know you now, Joy. They, they, like, they know you now, right? They know you yeah. now. But it was nice man. I'm I'm actually looking forward to doing more yeah, weddings too. Because I feel like food yeah. is just so important. Mm -hmm. Guys, food, Rock let's talk world. about the food. Yeah for your events. Mm -hmm. No matter what type of event me, you're having. He go wedding and the food not ready. And and not only that, do you see the thing is mm -hmm. when when it comes to food, mm -hmm. food is so important. Food is the most important thing I'd say at an event. At an event. And any wedding. And in the look of it too because it, it just really sucks to have this amazing decor. And then your food just not tying, like. Uh, yes, and I also think it's important to train your guests yeah, that's coming yeah, to your event yeah. on a dress code. Mm -hmm. I love a dress code. I, I don't want to have a wedding Last where. Last night with the all black. Yeah, that you know what? I want a wedding where everybody yeah. just wear whatever. I would love to have a themed where everyone dresses event, whether you're going yeah. all white, all black, or whatever. just even a style. Yes, because. Some people just show up at people wedding wearing any old thing. Oh so God. I really love the fact that she did the all yeah. black. I like I see like even with certain events that need you have, I like when they do an invite and they will add like like they have a website or a yes, page. To give you inspiration. And it shows you the inspo or whatever. And even last night with the it's nice when you have those bright colors and everybody coming black because then the, the green the chartreuse, stand out. It just stand out. Stand out. You know, it looked yes. nice. It was nice. Yeah. Manala, I like yeah. I really love the venue. Yeah. Um, and when you have a beautiful venue, you don't have to do too much. much. Mm -mm. You don't right? want to do too much. When there's a theme in the venue, because it was easy for us because it was like crystal everywhere. So it was nice to just have like a lot of reflection, so like yes. clear stuff, yes. mirrors, and then we we'll just have yes. like pops of the colors. Pops of the color. Right. And just make sure the food looks pretty mm -hmm. and the food tastes good. So mm -hmm. it was epic. It. it was epic. I do nice. look forward to more weddings. Yes. Um, back to what I was saying, why food is the most important yeah. thing. Just imagine everyone in there hungry. Mm. Nobody not happy. Nobody's gonna have fun. Hungry. So yeah, everyone is gonna be very hungry. Mm. You know how weddings usually don't start on time. They didn't do too bad with the time. The time was really the time good. Was I was good. impressed with that. Yeah, they didn't do too bad with the time. Mm. Um, you know, everything was ready. The, the kitchen had a warmer, so we were able to keep the food warm. We had everything out. To me, it was one of my favorite events. Mm, I liked it. Yeah, it was one of my favorite events. I really like the warmer thing for real because who wants cold food? Yeah. I like replenishing was replenishing easy. Replenishing was, was easy, exactly. Mm -hmm. um, the videographers, Delano. The energy alone, bro. Like, his energy was every yeah, like single thing. His quality thing. is good, but if his quality wasn't that great, just his energy, energy alone. Yeah, energy was everything. Mm -hmm. So she chose the right vendors, yeah. I think. Yeah. So Katrina, big up yourself, girl. Yeah. You did it. Yeah. Yes, all of the stress done. Right. Go enjoy your happy married life and just do the do because you know when you see people come together and they can make that union in these times yeah. you have to celebrate it's it and support it I, I felt like i was ready to be married last yeah night. she did last night she was like no i'm ready for married. <laughs> ready for married. 
<laughs> I'm like, if you're married, if you're married, we're gonna drink gum. Um, no, absolutely nobody. And then here goes Joel. Come on, if you're married. <laughs> Hear me not hear that hear me. Yeah, man, we do it for you. Yeah, we do it for kids. We do it for kids. Yeah. A bunch of people are asking me, like, are you married? Or are you gonna do you wanna get married? Like, mm. I'm not saying I would. Yeah, I'm not saying I would not get married. I, obviously, I would. Mm -hmm. But I feel like what I find these days mm -hmm. is that the men are scared to commit. I think that's my problem. And I don't want to force anybody to do that. Mm -mm. I don't want to force anybody. You know anybody. what it was about last night, though? It wasn't just the ceremony because, you know, the march shouldn't be able to ceremony. That's just the icing on the cake. But for me, based on like, the speeches I was hearing, I felt that's what kind of made me feel like, you know, I want a little have my back thing there. Yeah. You know what I mean? If, like to just unify, like it's like a public declaration, like this is us. This is us. And yeah. this is what we're doing. It's not really for, you know what it, I'm Yeah, saying? it takes a bowl. It takes a, I mean, like I said, but I'm going to blame this generation mm -hmm. for, you know, social media and stuff like that. Yeah, people or men, at least the men that I've been meeting, I don't know if I'm meeting the right, the wrong men or whatever, but I feel like, I don't know if it's because of my, um, a lot of them look at me like, oh, she's intimidating yeah, or whatever. I don't get that I'm intimidated. You I know, cannot understand so why. Nice. Like, I get it too. I'm trying to figure out like... Like what? as a professional woman, like when you're doing the thing, it's just not like a natural thing. Because you're sure of yourself. You're confident. You're So bold. what men want then? A dummy or somebody who... Know. Somebody who is... A yes um, girl. I don't know. I, yeah, <laughs> like I'm so confused. Like when people tell me, oh, you're too independent or you're too... No, you must do. What should you do though? I don't know. Why should you me time? Like... Yeah, like you're too independent or Aww. because you're such a boss lady, it intimidates men. So, so am I supposed okay. to shrink who I am no, to never. make a man feel better about never. himself? So that he can approach me the right way, no, like that's what I'm confused. That's when people ask me, I'll get married. I'm like, oh, is that the rate of things going right now? I don't think so because all the men are like scared of me or something. I'm like, am I scared? Am I that horrible of a person? No, she's so amazing. Like me, me, well, want is she married? Like. I don't see how many. You know, when you're such a loving person, you just want mm -hmm. that. Like, I just want that love. I know what I am. I just said, I don't see it happening yeah. because I feel like the yeah. people that are around me, them just. It's not you. I hope you know it's I don't know if they're weak or them just. I know you. It's, know. You're not the problem. I hope not. You're not. I don't know if I it's hope a not. You're not the problem. I hope you're I'm just not. The problem. not. You're so nice, literally. Like yeah, but being nice and being strong, so yeah, people can't you're a, handle that. To me, you're a strong nice. <laughs> like you're nice. Yeah, I feel like I don't think it's you. I'd more be like no, no, and I don't want to change. You know, sometimes you can adjust yeah. your yourself to the. You know, all right. For example, if I meet someone, I'm no longer gonna open my doors because right. he's gonna do. You're exclude. Yeah, it's, exactly. For, because for me, I feel like men look at me and think sure. she need designer. I need to be buying her this, or I need to be no. paying all her. Cause for me, you can't get whatever. There. That's what I try to say. But I'm okay with doing my stuff for myself. Mm -hmm. I, yes, you, it's you nice to have somebody to, to yeah. take a little, alleviate a little stress. Babe, I guess at the so that's car. not your love I, language. Your love no. language is like acts of service. Acts of service would be Words, my love language. Right. Yes. Not showing up. Yes. Not buy me a designer bag. Right. Or so not. This is not like the top. Yeah, of your but thing. I feel like I'm the image maybe you. that I put out there because of how I treat myself. Right. They come forward and then no, be like, you say, just want somebody that will make your life easier. So it's like it's just a thought that comes. Exactly. So it's like if you know I like this cereal. Yeah, you buy. And I feel like you surprised me. Oh my God, this person was thinking of me. Right. Yeah, just like. Stuff. So I feel like that's where I'm at. So yeah. when I see people getting married and a man actually make that move, they're mm -hmm. really happy Me for too. them because cool. I know, and I know I'm not the only woman yeah. going through that because I, I speak to other friends mm -hmm. and they're going through the same thing. Like they must have tea and a male, and it's all powerful women. The women that I feel like feel the same way like me are women who are doing. Yeah. The things most, them the, are do, the, yeah, they're excelling they're, they're excelling yeah, and they're at the top of their exactly game the, yeah I feel like the man them want and I get out of the, the whole time like, oh you look high mental and so exactly and really. like I used to date somebody back in the day mm -hmm. and he uh, nobody could understand oh, why didn't you break up and then know it makes sense mm -hmm. because then I see the type of woman that he goes for and it's women who are in feel like beneath him 
there. No disrespect to nobody, but that yes, like so it's like him feel like oh this person can't outgrow me and leave me. Yes. So they're gonna get somebody. Yes, so him choose somebody right. no who don't have no career like, like, or just me who, not, uh, you know like and for me it's sad because it's sad. A man supposed to want yeah, this. Not and true. The thing is that I don't understand is that we're not just gonna be like we meet today and we're gonna be submissive tomorrow. It's, no. If you if you show us that you can leave, a man bring that submissive. Right. We will go under that that oh, yeah. dream because it yeah. makes sense to us. But if you're not making no sense, why why am I going to just... And if I get the vibe that a man is like scared or yeah, intimidated by me, it's an immediate turn off. He's scared. Yeah, it's an immediate turn off. <laughs> All two hours is scared. One confident with us. Right. Right. All of your bank account is not fat. Yeah. That dream that makes sense. You're yeah. confident. You have a plan. Yeah. We can't work for that because it's going mm -hmm. somewhere. But yeah. if you're not sure, you'll... Yeah, I'll pay on pay on. I don't that. that. <laughs> Bro, I will walk oh all over God. you without trying because yeah, it's, it's like I have a plan. Yeah, I feel like we need a podcast. We need we need we need to talk about this somewhere because it's a real thing. And I know, like I said, a lot of female going through it. So mm -hmm. for the men out there watching, stop being scared. Stop being tell scared. Yes, yeah, stop <laughs> being scared. Go wipe up the girl that way yeah. out. Wait, What are you waiting? It's not. Like, she no, that's my thing. What are you waiting? <laughs> Because to me, I always say, from you meet somebody, you know yes. whether or not you could do life with this person. Yeah, you yeah. know. Like, within a month, you know. Like, mm, I could do life with this person. I yeah. feel like I've met also in my life, like, maybe three guys yeah. that is like, oh, I'm not ready because, because of, of X, Y, and Z. Because them that reach and them want to reach them that this them that that. I know it's like what. And then when you get there, you going to feel like there's something else you need to reach. Yeah, and you get I'm the, just like, like I'm not the one for you. Together, <laughs> like you know. Yeah, them that look on it that way. Them that look on it like okay, well, this person I can build life together, even though I'm not where I want to be. Yeah. If you give me me the love of my life, and I'm not feel like I'm not where it, mega making past me. I'm gonna work with him to get out and get there. Yeah, but I guess for men it's different. Because them feel like, oh, them ego and all that bullshit. Like, oh, whatever. Anyways, we totally jumped off on a whole different yeah. topic, honey. But back to the bride and groom. It Congrats. <laughs> Thank you for having us. And I hope you loved everything. We hope you loved everything. I know, love serving I know Patrina didn't, wasn't able to like bask in the moment right. because so much was going on. Yeah. At one point she was like, Tanisha, I like some of like the food. I know, I saw. I love the food, but, but she just, so much is going on and I can't. So that's why we end up making it. She's going like to process it yeah. when she come down and when she wants to see the clips and everything. But yeah. guys, it was gorgeous. And I don't know. Our brain was just like, all right, like we're in the stores getting the stuff yeah. and preparing. Or like, ah, oh, this, this would look nice. Blah, blah, blah. And we took a chance. Yeah. Because everything we're like, you know what, maybe we can't put this with this. Because for me, it's all about the details. Mm -hmm. So we're like, maybe we can put this with this and that with that and this and this and that and that. And mm -hmm. it worked. It really worked. It worked. Mm -hmm. So I have another wedding coming up in November. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be beautiful. Not Stay tuned for that one. Either. It's gonna be in or yeah, right? <laughs> it's gonna be in Orlando and then I'm traveling also to Arizona yeah. soon. So I have a lot of travel events come I'm going to Texas next week. So I have a lot of events coming up. Which I'm super grateful for. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and close this video out. By the way, if you guys have weddings anywhere in the world. Uh, fly me out, fly us out. We'll be knows. there. Exactly. Yeah. And if I can, I'll go too. Yeah, we'll be there. Yeah. Create an experience for yeah. you and your guests. Don't be scared, like, oh, she's that far. No, no, she moves. And I will come to Jamaica and <laughs> right. anywhere. Yeah. So I do Take look it to forward the next level. To that. Do something different. Yeah, man. You know? 2024, I come. Mm -hmm. And I already have people booking me all the way up until so far uh, April. Oh, so awesome. it's looking really positive for 2024. Busy, not Super dizzy. grateful. <laughs> Booked out, not. Oh. Tell a friend to tell a friend. <laughs> yep. Go ahead and like. Comment, like, share, subscribe, all of the good things. Them, let's continue to grow this channel. Make sure you guys are watching time. your ads. Big up on yourself. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Joel leaves me tomorrow. <laughs> you know it's gonna be funny if I'm still here. <laughs> <laughs> Is she gonna leave tomorrow? Or not gonna see me come by you again? <laughs> oh, we're gonna run a few last minute right, errands and then we'll catch up with you guys soon. So. See you soon. Bye. <laughs>